Hey, Lucy. Yeah? What was the first time you met? Of course, why? I don't know. Just thinking about it. Came by party and that girl threw a drink on you. Did you drink it? Wow, that's unfortunate. Seem more inconsiderate to me, but that's just how teenage girls are. Oh, come on, don't say that. Girls will have a monopoly on being jerks. Anyone could have spilled their drink on you just as easily. <laughs> yeah, see, you're the inconsiderate one, but you just disregarded half the population. How rude of me. Yeah, don't worry. I'll let it slide. I'm Michael, by the way. Lucy. Nice to meet you. You okay? Yeah, I, I just want to go home. I saw you come with some friends. Where'd they go? My friends, they left. Some friends. I know. I'll take you home. Isn't this your party? Yeah, doesn't matter. This is more important. Come on. The first time I asked you out? The first time you asked me out or the first time I said yes? <laughs> Good point. Yeah? Hey. Michael. What are you doing here? I didn't get your number at the party last night. What? I didn't get your number. And? So I came here. Why? Well, I didn't want to ask last night because you seemed upset. So you decided to come in the morning instead? Exactly. Now you had time to sleep on it. And now I can, can I get your number so I can see you again? I don't have to show up at your house randomly. Okay. Call me sometime. Hello? Hey, you busy? No. Come to dinner with me tonight. What? Come to dinner with me tonight. It'll be fun. I can't. Alright, what are you doing tomorrow? I'm busy. Monday? Michael. I can go all day. I'm sure you can. Remember the first time I cooked for you? The picnic? Yeah, first date. That was not our first date. Yes, it was. No, the first time I agreed to go on a date with you was to the movie the day after that. All right, maybe I didn't ask you, but it was still our first date. Wanna have a picnic? It's nice out. Ground. All right, well, let's come outside. Come on. We're gonna have fun. Come on, just trust me. I thought you were crazy. You mean charming? Keep telling yourself that. If you thought I was crazy, you wouldn't have been dating all those years. How did we make it so long anyway? We didn't. I didn't. Remember our first big fight? Yeah. I was being ridiculous. You didn't know. You're right, I didn't, but I should have. <laughs> Where the hell have you been? I'll call you back. No, just give me a few minutes. Hello to you too, then. Where have you been? You're supposed to be here two hours ago. I'm sorry, I distracted. What's the date, Lucy? What? It's... I'm so sorry. I had the whole night planned. All you had to do was show up, and you couldn't even care enough to do that. I'm sorry, Michael. It seems like you're always distracted recently. I just have a lot going on right now, okay? Who are you on the phone with, anyway? Nobody! Let's just have fun today, okay? I'm sorry I was late. You're always distracted recently. Even when I'm with you, you're not here. Don't make it out to be like that, Michael. Why? Why can't you tell me what's going on? We can't even go, go out to dinner anymore. It's like I'm dating a freaking ghost. 
Please just stop. I should have to tell you every single move I ever make. What, do I put a GPS in my phone, track my every move? Well, maybe I know where you are sometimes. Michael, please stop yelling. Stop yelling? I'll stop yelling when you start telling me what's going on. Lately, it's been like I'm your friend you're forced to hang out with. You know that's not true. It's been a year. How can you- Oh, so it has been a year. I thought I was the only one who knew that since you didn't even care enough to show up on time tonight. Stop, please. Stop. I'm not even asking you to make me your first choice, Lucy. I just thought I said it would be important to you. It is important, I promise. Oh, we have a great way of showing it. You know what? I set up a picnic at your favorite spot. Maybe you can call your friend back and he can make it. I know that I have like some trust issues, but like, I don't think it's anything to break up over. Like I'm, I'm willing to try. I want to keep going. Like I, I don't want this to end. It's worth trying. It hurts too much. I can't. Where do I go after this? What do I do? I don't We're, know. Like we talk about being together, like to the day we die. And I just figured like that's what was gonna be. Yeah. I know. I'm on my way. Connie, I'm fine. I can drive. I'm on my way. I'll be there soon. Connie, I said I'd be there soon. Alright, I'll see you there. Yeah. What was she saying? The service starts soon. She gets somebody to leave. This will never leave. You're always late. I thought you broke up with me because you wanted somebody better. Just for me to find out that you were asking to see me, that you changed hospitals to go to a specialist the doctor recommended. Your mom told me she'd expected me to be there by now if she was being honest, because we all knew you didn't have all too much time left. Asked if I needed a ride, that your brother could pick me up on his way. Do you remember the last thing I ever said to you? Neither do I. You didn't give me enough time. <laughs>